Hi Gemini, it's Tuesday. Look, my candle is almost out of wax. Isn't that crazy? I have a refill though. Check it out. Oh. Okay, hi guys, how are you? We're gonna do a reading real quick. Gonna be a quick one. But I um, I have a really, now the, the tarot spread could come out different, but I have a really good idea of it already from the pre-shuffle, so we'll see. Um, so it's general, of course, it cannot resonate for everyone. Just take what resonates and leave the rest. So here we have the seven of cups, which is confusion. And it, it's, it's not funny, but it's kind of funny. <laughs> Sorry. See, these cards are so awesome because instead of going like upside down, they go backwards, which kind of gives you a little different of a, of a meaning. Or it does me. I'm still learning this deck, but I'm really loving it. Anyway, so we have the Six of Swords in reverse. So Six of Swords, you know, is leaving a difficult situation. Um, but that, this is in, is, it's backwards. So it looks like you just keep stepping right back into it. And it's some, it's not funny. I don't know why I'm laughing. <laughs> but it's, it's, it's almost like, I feel like there's an energy. You keep trying to make it better something better but it just gets worse or it's not helping something like that see this this wheel and it's like oh what did i do you know why did i even bother why what did i say but you just keep trying like god love you guys you know you keep trying but it's like oh why did i go why did i walk back into that trap something like that okay <laughs> see that see i mean see this it's it the reason I'm I'm getting a kind of a kick out of it is because it's almost like a meme, you know? It's like, can y'all see that? What did I do? You know? Can y'all see? Hmm, let me block the candle. But see this image? It's like there it goes. It's like, ah, oh, I can, I can feel, it's like, I feel like that's you. And it's like forehead slap, you know, it's like, ah, right. But you don't give up. The nine of swords is like wounded and, and it's, it's been, you know, been through the ringer, but not giving up, not giving up again and again, right. Going around that again. And here again, we have the 10 of wands. Just like all these are, all these look like tries to me. Try again, try again, try again. Forehead slap. Ah. I love you guys. I hope that didn't offend anybody. That's, I mean, anyway, we'll see. What, <laughs> we'll see what, I don't know why. This is making me laugh. Does anybody else kind of see what I'm saying? The whole forehead slap thing? God, come on, camera. Oh, that's frustrating. I'm sorry. Okay. And then there's like this confusion again. Ah, oh, what did I do? It's not you, though. I'm just telling you. It's not you. Okay. All right. How are you guys? This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I feel like something's going to like become very clear here. Oh, an end. A cycle ending. Yay. Love that. What's going on with my light? There we go. Now let me see if I can show you this. I'm sorry. Okay. Well, forehead slap is why that's making me kind of giggle. <gasps> oh, see? Look. Judgment. Judgment is a judgment call. It's like something is being revealed. It's karma. I feel like there's something that's not fair that's happened and that just is like perpetuating, but you try to explain it. You guys let me know in the comments. Am I, is this, I mean, am I on, I feel this really strong, but it's like, you keep trying, you keep trying and, but you keep getting, you know, oh, well that didn't work. It's almost like the more you say, the, the more gets turned or twisted on you. Judgment that with the world card, where do we just have the world card? This is a cycle completion and it's a karma. It, 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 like the universe steps in and goes, uh-uh-uh, enough, enough. Like they come in and rescue you and, you know, I probably expose somebody. We're probably going to get like um, some information, some cards about truth and lies and um, 
you know, like the moon card. So I think something's going to be exposed, and it's something that you've been re trying really hard to, like, clear up, but it's, I don't know, maybe a hater. Sometimes it's, it's better, sometimes the less we say the better, because when you're dealing with certain people, they just find a way to turn everything on you, you know, look at that, you're going to be recognized, Six of Wands, I love it. Four of Pentacles, that is protecting yourself. Um, it also could be fear of lack. Let's see, let's look at your energy. The devil. Are you obsessing over this, maybe? Nine of Cups. Self-love, I like that. This is wish fulfillment. Um, three of Pentacles. Okay, let's look at the person you're thinking about. I don't know what that devil card is about. You may be dealing with a, a Capricorn. Strength, holding back. Ooh, oh. Strong Leo, and this is the second time this came out, but I'm not sure it's for them. But this is the strength card. So strong Leo energy here, and then four of wands, union together. That's togetherness. Rules could be reversed, but you know that's foundations. Could be twin flame. Don't like to use that word lightly. Okay, recent past. Look, this won't leave us alone. This is like getting defensive, feeling defensive, standing up for yourself, but having all those, it's like, is each one of these a lie, or is each one of these um, wands coming at you? Is this all like, I'm going to try and get you from here, I'm going to try and get you, I don't know, I feel like there's something like that. You guys let me know. Knight of Cups. Hmm. There you go. Somebody is trying to keep the truth from being revealed. Ace of Swords. This is the one I was feeling in the beginning where I said truth and clarity is going to come out. Um, hmm, I don't know why we have to. Okay, let's keep going. Nine of Wands again. That's that one I was laughing at. The head slap, forehead slap. Nine of Wands. So, you know, standing strong, holding your ground. So it's not over. I mean, it's in the past and the upcoming. But this is like, no, I'm not giving up. And I'm, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit back. Um, and and I, death card. Whoops. Nine of Wands is like protecting what you know. Um is true, is right. King of Wands. Ooh, Queen of Swords, truth. Her, her sword is up. That's a lot of mental energy. But the Queen of Swords is someone who speaks truth. She doesn't mince words. And you know, for some of you, Gemini, you might have been like, ooh, 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 look at this, yeah. Something's ending. So seven of swords, that's deceit, lies, betrayal. Three of swords, something painful and walking away from it. So definitely this type of person or situation you've been in. Let's see what the devil card is. You think it, you're, that's what's on your mind. So you're thinking about something that's toxic. Trying to make up what make up your mind, what to do. I feel like you just keep trying, but it's not helping. Um, you know, like sometimes the more you say, the more somebody can. Like your intentions are so good. Maybe you're even trying to, like buffer a little bit to be nice about it. This almost came out a minute ago. The hermit. So that's trying to see things from a different perspective. That's the hermit. Like shuts out all the noise. <clears throat> Look at that, Ace of Wands, stable new beginnings. King of Cups. Yeah. 
That's amazing. Ace of Pentacles is like a, almost like a major arcana. I mean, that is an amazing card because this is a stable new beginning. And this King of Cups is, there's a lot of love. Um, let's see, what do we need to ask? How does it, uh, I don't know, what do we need to ask? Okay, just tell me more, what does Gemini need to know? Wow, Ace of Pentacles and Ace of Cups. So truth, stability, look at this, all four. The only one we don't have is Ace of Wands. Look at these three aces. I mean, this is beautiful. A truth and clarity. Stability. This is also material. Ab abundance. And then you have love. New everything. New, new clarity. The Ace of Swords is exactly what I was picking up in the beginning. The Ace of Swords is it's victory after a, a battle. And I feel like you've been through it. Ace of Pentacles and Ace of Cups. Four of Swords. But see, the Four of Swords is about removing yourself. It's it's a battle going on, and it's not that you're it's that the battle is over, but you remove yourself. I saw it, like Virgo had kind of a reading like this, where it was like they the message was real strong. Once you stop trying to fix it or trying to, you know, get an outcome by taking action to get an outcome um, it's like once once you can do that you it, it works out for you three of pentacles yeah cooperation collaboration doesn't look like it in this deck does it look like she's got her back turned but it this is two people working towards the same goal i want to see what's going on with your person um okay temperance queen of pentacles this is all about stability, temperances, balance. I mean, your person looks more stable than you do. I'm <laughs> sorry. I'm just full of compliments tonight, aren't I? It's like 2 in the morning. Set a strength card. Leo, um, but also, you know, the lion and the lamb. And it's balance. Again, it would balance, balance. And it create you know, once you can balance things out, look at that. That's four of wands, 11, 11. Every time you guys keep your eye out for 11, 11, every time you see 11, 11, just let this be a reminder that um, to kind of, you know, not knee jerk and react to say, I feel like some, I feel like there's somebody or something where it, it may be doing it on purpose, but trying to make you look bad or maybe not doing it on purpose, but there's like a, uh, it's, it's a, being misunderstood. And the more you try and fix it, the, 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 the more you, it's kind of like the more you kind of look, I don't know, come across wrong or something. I don't know, page of swords. Yeah, and I do, I, there is a little bit of obsession here. Somebody is obsessed watching you or you're watching them. High priestess, wow. But it's, I mean, let's focus on what, what the main, what the, the main thing was. I mean, you've got good stuff coming. You've got a new clear beginning. You have love coming. You've got ace of swords, ace of pentacles, and ace of cups. Now here we have the ten of cups, and this is, this is a truth. This is all knowing, but remember, what I love about the high priestess is, you know, it drives us crazy to, to know the truth and other people not know it. It drives us crazy, but she's, I love about her is she'll sit back. She's kind of aloof. She's like, yeah, I'll just watch this all play out. She doesn't have to say it. She doesn't have to say too much. She doesn't over speak. You know, she, she actually does the opposite. She sits back and she's kind of like, mm, we'll see what happens. She knows the truth, but she doesn't feel the need to, um, 
to say it. Now this guy, this guy is very investigative, investigative. The Page of Swords, wanting information. Yeah, somebody's being very deceptive, but they're going to be exposed. And I think it, you got it like a hater. I hate to use, I hate to use the word hater, but that's what it looks like. Um, when everything's going to pan out, there's a strong element of forehead slap, uh, <laughs> conflict. But you know, you know, I'm very empathic. So if there was something that was going to be, so this is good, or I would be feel and wouldn't be laughing wouldn't be feeling silly. Uh, let's do a manifestation card real quick. Shall we? That's exciting. I mean, I, 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 I obsess. When somebody's wronged me and I'm like misunderstood or somebody's lied about me, oh my gosh, I, it, I can't deal. I don't get it. I don't understand deceitful people. I don't understand lies. I mean, I'm talking about intentional, you know, I'm not talking about, um, you look beautiful today when someone doesn't, I'm not talking about look that kind of, I'm talking about deception, intentional deception to hurt people. I don't get it and it drives me nuts and I obsess. Wanting more for others puts me in an energy of abundance. That's nice. Wow. So strong vibes here about aligning with spirit and trusting. My true safety lies in my capacity to align with the love of the universe. I choose to be a super attractor and have unwavering faith in the universe. Yeah, exactly. Stop. You don't have to make this. You don't have to. Um, I wouldn't need to listen to my own advice. You don't have to expose this person. Um, and maybe, maybe like the more you try, the more they the aggressive they get. I just I feel like it's really unfair to you, and I just I, I'm sorry, and I, I just did get a kind of big wave of not that's not my I mean something really wave, weighing heavy on you. Be mindful of the tendency toward negative self-talk and other limiting behaviors that you can that can keep you stagnant and energetically depleted. This is what we needed. Jeez. Well. Ugh. Sorry. Well, I read it to you, I guess. But I mean, exactly. Practice positive positive positivity it's like you have somebody that is constantly dragging you trying to drag you down and you keep trying to fix it but you don't have to channeling oh i like this we got the high priestess too you have the ability to convey messages from spirit this is anchored with a quiet mind removing expectations and an openness to receive so we're going to do a group manifestation in, in one of your upcoming videos right now. I, I did it in the Leo video and I can only, um, I can only do so much at a time, but keep your eye out for that. I'll put in the, you can, you can join in on the Leo video if you want. It's Leo video from the 20, June 26th and you can see in the comments, but feel free to join in on that one. Um, but I like to go in and help each and every person that puts their manifestation in the comments. I like to go in and specifically send, you know, double down and, and try and give power and help them manifest that. So I only, I'm only doing one video, one sign at a time, but you're welcome to go in. I can't check all this messages every, anyway, I'll stop talking. I love you guys. This is important. Okay. You can relax. No more of this. Did you hear that sound effect? I love you guys. Bye, Gemini. Oh, let me know in the comments, and I'll see you soon. Bye, Gemini.